one of our clients, a major healthcare organization, had a very niche specialized need to build a IT team that would lead their government reimbursement program. And such skill in healthcare and government reimbursements, it's, it's very niche and it requires very specialized skill set. It's not very advanced. It's not, it's not, I wouldn't classify that as a high tech, but at the same time, it's very, it's very specific. We were interviewing highly, highly experienced folks. Someone who has, you know, 15, 20 plus years of experience in that particular field. But the challenge with those individuals was also that we wanted them to join a very fast paced, highly innovative team that was set out to be almost uh, building kind of a startup like culture. And for individuals with that much wealth of experience, they were kind of almost already set on their ways of doing things, uh, their own preferred methods. So we found that as a challenge for them to be able to adjust to that type of culture that we wanted to build for this particular client. And we've set out to really focus more on finding candidates that fit more on the soft skill side to match the criteria of being very hungry, uh, willingness to learn, someone who is very flexible and nimble, which meant we had to sacrifice on some of the strengths that we initially thought were important. And that really fell into the category of what are the what are the weaknesses that you can tolerate? So we were able to identify that really experience in that particular field was a weakness that we could tolerate. And instead, we really focused on building a very robust training and onboarding uh, documentation for those folks to join with not a wealth of experience, but be able to absorb that training guide and really hit the ground running. So that was really one of the success factors that led to building a very, very high performing team to focus more on that soft skill, someone who is very hungry and to summarize, really invest into that training and onboarding uh, process, which was then later adopted by a lot of, a lot of other divisions within the organization.